I want to show you my favorite garden. It is a place to relax and learn about sustainable gardening. Here at the UC Davis Arboretum, you can discover the possibilities for your own piece of earth. It could be a beautiful California garden. Come and explore the magic and beauty of trees, shrubs, and flowers. Combined in tapestries around the waterway, they are home to many birds and beneficial insects. This is a place to engage the body and mind, to find the meaning of beauty, harmony, fond memories, companionship, and knowledge. No matter who you are, this place has many treasures for you to find. The UC Davis Arboretum has layers of history. Like tree rings created over time, each layer is someone who cared about the Arboretum and worked to preserve it. Here at the Arboretum, you can experience nature, learn about gardening, and learn about your local ecology. Our collections are quite diverse. Here we are at the cool and serene Redwood Grove, but not far away. So Mary, can you tell us what makes this a really great drought tolerant garden? Well, one of the important things is that we've selected some of the great California natives to use in this garden. They're very drought tolerant. This is the California white sage. Um, great plant to use in the back of the garden, very sculptural, and of course the insects, the beneficial insects, love it. We've also used some of these Arboretum All-Stars. They're plants that we've specially selected that do particularly well in the California Valley and put on a great summer display of color. The plants in this garden are well adapted to our region, but the connection runs deeper. They support and sustain the larger ecosystem in which we live. Right now, this garden is a ballroom for flowers and pollinators to perform their ancient dance. These same insects will be visiting other plants, both wild and cultivated, in the surrounding area. All the Earth is in motion, from the smallest molecule to the planet itself. Just as winter gives way to the abundance of spring, old ways of understanding give way to new. We see the natural world as beautiful, but if nature is to survive, we must see ourselves as part of it. It is up to us to nurture and protect the natural world around us, protect our home. Our efforts today will shape what the world looks like tomorrow. Experiencing nature in the garden reconnects us to the natural world. What kind of practices? Less use of pesticides healthier environment for our communities. Now that you've experienced our favorite garden, take home the inspiration from the UC Davis Arboretum to your own piece of earth.